Did you see the insurance fraud dash cam video? That's a negative. Let's check it out. Driver backs into fake rear end crash and passengers pretend to be hurt for insurance fraud. You know, I've always imagined that like somebody somewhere is going to try to do this. Just like since the beginning of time of me riding in cars, I always imagined this as a reality. But this is the first time seeing it. Let's check it out. But it's crazy. Like he had one hand on the... What the... Oh my god! Oh, fail. Oh, what oh, happened, babe? Uh, ah, ah, oh my god, what is he doing? Babe! Babe, what happened? Uh, failed on the, like, the cutting off part of things, so I just threw it in reverse. Just, just, couldn't let it, oh man. I don't know. Babe. I got into an accident. I got into an accident. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, Where are babe. you? I'm on the Bell Parkway. Look at the date, bottom right. Oh, it's in the way, look. This guy just reversed into me. What the hell is- 10-16, this is two days ago. What's going on? Reversed into you? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, fuck, oh, I'm shaking. Oh my god. Babe, babe, babe. Yeah. Just stay there. Oh my god. Fuck, oh my god. We're oh my... on the Bell Parkway. Oh, uh, holy shit. You know after that turn? Yeah. Fuck. Oh my it's, god. It's okay. Hold on a second. Did we... Did they just change seats? I just want to go back and check this out. Hold on, let's rewind. We're just going to play it out. Okay, so... It happens here. Okay, hold on. They b crash. Then they pull... Okay, l I'm going backwards. Now I'm going forward. They back end. They crash. Is that, sh that shatters their back windshield. Pulls forward. Puts it in park and then is crossing. He's crossing to the other side. They're, they're changing seats. Look at that. It's, they're changing seats. Let me play it without me just fast forwarding. Let's see that. Hey, what happened? Oh, shit. I don't know. Wait. I got into an accident. Yeah, got they're changing accident. seats. Oh my God. That's oh why the whole God. car is moving around. I'm on the Bell Parkway. This guy just reversed into me. What the hell is going on? And now Reversing a you? woman. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh, Look at them oh, hold their head like, oh my God. Babe, babe, babe. That's yeah. diabolical. Oh my God. Fuck, oh my God. We're on the Bell Parkway. Oh, uh, holy shit. You know, after that turn. She is panicking. She doesn't even yeah. realize what happened. Oh my babe, God. It's okay. It's All right, hold on. Now they're filming. Oh, my back. Oh, I'm in so much pain. Oh, grabbing his knees. The whole, the whole team of them. Now they're all out with phones. Oh, fuck. Oh, I think they see the dash cam. The guy just saw the dash cam, I think. Hold on, let's rewind. Did he see the dash cam? He walks up to see if he can see his eyes. Oh, yeah, he just saw... You see that? He just saw the dash cam. Hold on, babe. Oh, you're cooked, bro. Yep, it's wait, all wait, over wait. now. You're cooked. You're on dash cam now. See, like, if you know you're falling asleep like that, you need to pull over. Get, get off yeah. the highway. Like, I didn't crazy. Like, he had one There's nothing the to see oh back God. here. Or maybe there is. What, what happened, babe? Uh, this one ah! immediately oh threw God, on hazards. Babe! Babe, what happened? Oh, shit. Why'd that car immediately throw on hazards? That's know. crazy. Wait. I got into an accident. I got into an accident. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Where are babe. you? I'm on the Bell Parkway. This guy just reversed into me. What the hell is going on? Reversed into you? Yeah. I feel bad for her. I feel so bad. She's freaking out, dude. She didn't do anything wrong. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold on. Let's see if we can. Oh, that red car pulled in front. Look, there's a red car pulled in front. They got to be together. This is in on it. That red car. Hold on. Let's back up. Oh, oh yeah, God. red car pulls in front. Babe, babe, babe. Yeah. Just yep. stay there. That car is in on it. Oh my God. Fuck, oh my God. Oh We're my... on the Bell Parkway. Oh, uh, holy shit. You know, after that turn. There's four people. Yeah. Fuck. Oh my babe, God. It's okay. Oh, hold on. Fuck. That guy just walked away to the red car. Look it. Hold on, babe. Hold on. Oh, this guy babe, right here on okay. the right. Just, right. Hold on, hold on. Just... Hold on, okay. He walks forward, and he, we never see his face. At least, I don't think so. 
Hold on. This dude. guy walks up. He sees the camera. Oh, oh shit. Oh. This is crazy. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god. And then the, they like drove away. Really Did you see that? They drove away. Life. Red car is pulling away. Drove off. What? That's crazy. All right, let's track this video down. Okay, here's her page. Here's That's the original terrible. video, I think. It seemed this one is shorter. So when I open this video up, That's terrible. this one's only 52 seconds. But the one that we watched has both a rear. Oh, this one has a rear as well. For some reason, the one that's on Twitter is longer. So I'm, th I'm assuming something got taken down from this account or it was posted elsewhere. Uh, hey but I'm, I'm assuming something happened. It's taken down. Hey I don't know why. Um, hey Here guys. is an update um, video. I just to give a little bit of an that's, uh, that's an explanation of what, what happened here. So let's listen to this. Hey guys, um, I just wanted to give a little bit of an explanation as to what happened, as well as try to answer some questions you guys had. I'm also going to try to link the dash cam that we use. Um, I highly recommend anyone with a vehicle get one because it will save you so much trouble and so much money. I'm going to second this. Uh, I have a different one. Uh, I don't know about this, this dash cam right here, but I have a story that I haven't told on my channel yet. Uh, it's a Karen story. And dash can saved my ass. So my initial thought when we crashed was that I was involved in some road rage because it, everything just seemed very shady, like they just came out of nowhere. But then when I noticed them coming out of the car, they just looked like they were really scared and, you know, it was like genuinely like an accident. Yeah, um, yeah sorry to keep pausing. That acting was like, you know, Oscar worthy, right? They come out and they're like, oh man, and they're bending over like they're in so much pain, all this stuff. That is terrible. And the thing that messed it up, the dude went in reverse. What a dummy. The first thing the guy told me was that uh, his wife uh, was the driver and that she doesn't speak any English. Um, I didn't notice the fourth person, the actual driver. I didn't notice it at the time that he was driving or that he had left in a second vehicle. So we kind of just handled it like an accident. I called the police. Um, they told me that as long as no one was injured right. and everyone was willing to exchange information, they don't arrive at the scene anymore, like of an accident, unless the So the police are like, there's so many things that they're useless for. There's nothing they can do and for so many things. And this is one of them. And it's bullshit because these people like didn't just do insurance scam but there's so many other crimes being committed here too very dangerous driving like that's worthy of police attention there's footage of it but because of the nature of it they're just going to point everything at insurance this big insurance scam i think insurance is a scam sorry don't get me started on insurance but basically it's all bs we have to wait for the insurance scam company to go through it before anything can really happen and that's like that totally sucks because there's like a obvious victim here of a crime you know like it, this was not necessarily some accident this was on purpose doing like crashing into another vehicle that's insane the cops not getting involved in someone on purpose crashing into another vehicle in the middle of the road that's insane someone was uh, physically you know hit by a car um they were very quick to exchange like my license and my insurance and registration and everything so i didn't think anything of it that water, babe. i asked them if they can just wait for my husband because he you. was on his way i was on the phone with him when it happened and um they just kept saying that they need to they need to leave right away they had to go pick up their baby there was a tow truck that <sighs> showed up on the highway and so my husband was like go check on the car and make sure there's no like lights that came up and that we are able to drive it so as soon as I went to go check on the car, I turned around and they basically got in their car and left. Yep. It wasn't until I got home and rewatched the video because I just, everything happened so fast. I was like even second doubting myself. I bet. That makes um, sense. But once we watched the video over and over again, yep. it pretty much confirmed that it was a setup. So we went to yep. the precinct. Um, we tried to file a police report for insurance fraud, but they told us the same thing that they told us over the phone that we have to wait for insurance. Um, and then the later that night, I went back to the precinct and I tried to file a police report for assault and right. hit and run because that's go. when I realized that the female who gave me her information was not the driver. 
Mm -hmm. um, we showed the cop the video and she was definitely surprised and shocked because she said she'd never seen something like that either. I just want to stop here and uh, make a point that even though it's like, so it's, I'm complaining about the cops not doing anything, right? They're not able to be helpful. But even though you might come to that conclusion because that's like the reality of the world, uh, if it's important enough to you, the more you, you keep bothering the cops about it, the more likely they'll look into it. It's like they might tell you no a bunch of times or whatever, but if you're persistent, and uh, this is just from personal experience too, uh, if don't just give up immediately because you think the cops aren't going to do anything. Go file a police report and push and push for justice if justice is needed. I just want like PSA. Just it's you know in business we call it the squeaky wheel gets the grease right. If you're annoying, they're going to look at it. All right, just be annoying, especially if there's an in, if there's a true injustice. Seek justice. Seek it, and you have to fight for it. It doesn't. You would. The world seems like you know. You would want the world to to be more just, and if justice is deserved, it just happens without fighting for it. But you, no, these days you got to fight for it. Go bother the cops until they help you. So just PSA. Sorry, let's get back to the story. But she also she gave us a police report to. So uh, my wife's over there nodding her head like, yup, yup. She knows what I'm talking about. Um, to to mail back to insurance as well. We don't really have an update right now since it's only been two days. Um, we definitely want to press charges. Um, we tried to speak to a lawyer. They kind of told us the same thing, that we have to wait for insurance. So hopefully once we get that update, <sighs> um, I will try to update everyone as well. Um, That's so frustrating. That's so frustrating, but it's the process. The thing that just bothers me the most is that uh, we have to wait for insurance. They have to wait for insurance because... Of why? I mean, it, it doesn't make sense because it's there was like a, a physical crime, you know, like a dangerous one where potential injury could have happened. This is a, you know, I don't know. It's a, it's a vehicle purposely smashing into another. That's insane. That's crazy to me that even with video evidence, it's they're like, yeah, just go through the insurance. Um, someone it's just, the, what kind it's of just the process of things. Anyways, I just hope they find justice. The more they bother the cops, I think that that's. You know, the more likely they're going to get the justice. But don't just let it go. Don't let it go. They shouldn't let it go. And again, once PSA to everyone, if something is an injustice to you, true injustice, and you have evidence to back it up, even if you don't, just, just fight for yourself. Be annoying to the cops until they help you. Because they really, at the end of the day, they're just like everyone else. They just want to get off work. You know? I don't know. And it sucks, but that's the way it is. Okay. Next subject.